Volvo knows the way into the future and the future is electric. Uh, good morning. I'm here at the Siam Square one. And the reason that I'm here is because I want to give an update regarding a phenomenon that I noticed popping up everywhere in town. And these are these charge stations. And this is a charge station made by GWM, the Great Wall Motors, a Chinese brand of uh, electrical cars. And uh, yeah, it's just interesting to see everywhere throughout Bangkok these kind of stations popping up you have like small spaces where there are only two places in this case there are six and uh, I already made a video earlier so I will show you a bit how it looks when the cars are here and yeah of course the main player with electrical cars in the world is Tesla but uh, I see this GWM popping up everywhere and there's a sales office over there as well so let's go and have a look and then i will show you a few more charging stations so this is the smaller car i just walked in here so i have absolutely no idea so this seems to be one million baht This is not uh, not a sponsored video, so this is not a promotional video. I'm just uh, interested to see about the new technology. Yeah, from here you actually have a nice view of the of the charging station they call it the G charge but I saw there is a new charging station at the Benja Kitty Park one that's made by the government and I've seen several charging stations all over town so let me just show you around a little bit I'm here at the parking space of the Benja Kitty Park and here they also recently opened two charging stations And uh, yeah, this is perfect. If you go with your car, with your electrical car to the park, then you can just charge it here for free. Here in the central Silam Mall, we also have a GWM dealership. It's a nice shop. It's already come. So I'm here at the International Motor Show. Yeah, so these cars will have a range, or they have a range of 400 kilometers once they are fully charged. And there are a lot more models here than in the showroom where I was the other day. Yeah, I think uh, GWM is making a big push to get into the electric market. So this one's called the Tank 300. <laughs> This is a Foxtron, which is a car from Taiwan. I've never seen them on the street, not yes, yet. <laughs> but this is like a prototype one. Okay. Your okay. concept car is there. Okay. Yeah, because this is a platform. You you can show me, right? Another another service from 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 Taiwan. We have the Uni platform. 
Yes. Yeah, the EVB is like a rent rent service. Okay. So it, it allows the the customer to have the experiences of driving the EV. Okay. Yeah. So okay. They, they can choose different different um different car in the fleet. Did you try already? Not yet. <laughs> <laughs> because I'm working. Yeah, exactly, <laughs> exactly. Working. But yeah, this is a thing that we would like the customer to have the experience with the driving an EV driving okay. experience. And this is an app or uh... it's an application you can download. Okay. The application is called um EV Me. Okay, so I will edit the, the yeah. application in here. Yeah. You will see the EV Me. EV Me. Okay. Yes. Okay. So you can try. Okay. Yeah. Kapu makap. Sorry, what is your name? Nunu. Kununu. Yeah. Nice to meet you, Kununu. Nice to meet you too. Okay, thank you. Thank bye bye. So here you have a Tesla. So they have a Tesla here on the show, but it's part of the EV Me app. So Tesla doesn't have its own booth. So basically, with this app, you can rent and try electric cars. Yeah, I'm specifically interested in this electric car business. It's changing a lot the world. So what they have? Oh. Wow, this is actually really cool. So here's another one of these Fox trucks. So I've been showing the GWMs from China, so the Foxtron is the competition from Taiwan. Yeah, it's interesting to see a car without the motor block in it. And just to have an idea how big the batteries are, this is a battery that goes into the Volvo. So Volvo is giving a, a little demonstration, so let's have a look. So I think Volvo is spot on with this one. โวลโวค่ะมุ่งมั่นที่จะเป็นแบรนด์รถยนต์ที่ขับเคลื่อนด้วยพลังงานไฟฟ้าโดยสมบูรณ์ภายในปี 2563 วันนี้เรา Volvo C40 Recharge Pure Electric นอกจากรถทั้งสองรุ่นนี้เรายังมีรถยนต์ Basically, the wall box that is come from like Spain, we imported it. Okay. And we also like for a distributor and installer. Okay. And the charger is normally have to like to power time like for single phase and for three phase. Okay. For single phase, it will have it can like give the power of like seven point four kilowatt. Okay. And for three phase, it's twenty two kilowatt. You can change the um. Okay. For 40 OU meter, which is like after 4 pm, after 10, 10 pm, the cost of electricity will is lower. Okay, okay, so you okay, that makes sense. Uh, as the model have, have this feature, but for for this model, it's more efficient. Okay, okay. Thank you so much. Sorry, what is your name? Yen. Yen. Kun Yen. Nice to meet you. Kafuma Tap. Here in Sukhumitsoi 61, there is a new ALT eatery and here in the back you have a charge which is a charging station and you see these stations popping up all over town. Yeah, this just opened a few days ago. So here you have the charging station, again a big part in the evolution of electric cars here in Bangkok. So I hope you enjoyed this update regarding 
the electric car or electric transport revolution in Bangkok. If you did, feel free to subscribe, drop me a line. I see you guys in my next uh, video. Uh,